An outpouring of support at Comstock Park High School today as hundreds in the community pay tribute to Captain Miguel Nava, a West Michigan Marine who lost his life in a helicopter crash. News 8's Byron Tollison talked with those who knew him best as they remembered his inspiring life. A powerful tribute to a West Michigan Marine who gave everything for his country. Comstock Park High School filled with hundreds of people Sunday, honoring 2013 graduate Captain Miguel Nava. He really was probably one of the best leaders that we've seen come out of Comstock Park. The 28-year-old was killed, along with four other Marines, after their helicopter crashed during a training operation outside San Diego last month. His friends, family, teachers say his legacy will endure because of his drive and passion to leave a positive impact on his community. I know uh, growing up, Miguel looked up to me, um, but I look up to Miguel. I mean, it is just such an honor to see what he's done uh, and what he's accomplished uh, in his 28 years of life. It is, I, I look up to Miguel. More than 75 veterans with the American Legion from across the state rode together to the memorial. American flags lined up both sides of North Division Avenue for the mile and a half leading up to the high school. At the destination, a fire truck lifted a large flag over the entrance, and veterans filled the sidewalks with flags of their own as the community walked in. One of them, the state captain for the Patriot Guard Riders, who honor and support families of fallen warriors. Captain Nava was a, a hero, clear and simple as that, and, and he stood for us, so we wanted to stand for him. Nava's uncle, Brian Marks, says he always talked about being a pilot, starting when Marks, a pilot himself, took him for a ride as a boy. From that moment on, he, he, he knew he was going to be a pilot, uh, and he knew that his best way to be a pilot, get the best training, was to join the military. At Comstock Park High School, Nava played soccer and was a kicker for the football team. His teammates say he was a pillar in the locker room. There was a couple times he'd get pretty riled up and pumped up, and the smile on his face in a serious moment was very calming in those big games. Nava's teachers say he excelled in school, was wise and mature beyond his years, and displayed a rare humility and appreciation for the sacrifices that his parents made. He had these lofty goals. He had the drive the direction to to realize those dreams but he never forgot where he came from his uncle says his call to service came from his father who immigrated from mexico to become a u.s citizen wanting to leave a lasting legacy he says nava fulfilled dreams that most could never imagine he was a natural born leader and i hope that's what people take from this uh, i hope that that can spur another generation of leaders and teachers Nava is survived by his son, just born last year, and his wife. Be the, probably the best dad that would have walked this earth or is, has walked this earth. And to see that taken away from one of our best friends so soon and so young in his family's life, it, yeah, I mean, it makes you hug your loved ones a lot closer and make sure you say, I love you. In Comstock Park, Byron Tollefson, News 8.